seaweeds here are fundamentally three kinds, red, green, and brown. Very simple, as, as the seaweeds are. And the greens, for the most part, this is the most recognizable one, Ovalatuca, and it's sea lettuce. It's very easy to introduce to people uh, in terms of uh, introducing them to my wild ocean garden. And it's locally known as sea lettuce. High in astringent properties, great with the chlorophyll. We use it extensively throughout our products. And I work with chefs on it as well. The, uh, and a very good example of the reds is this one here. The red seaweed is iridia. Uh, we were looking at it earlier with its um, iridescent properties. And it actually flashes beautiful blues uh, in the ocean with some sunlight. It's a very uh, textured, satiny, silky uh, seaweed. We use it in our facial products. It has a fermented plum type taste to it. And it's very, very high in beta carotene, which is, you know, really what people like to know when they're putting products on their face. That's the stuff, the, the vitamins that um, is good for uh, uh, lines, wrinkles, uh, that kind of thing. So it's a really nice and the tough, tough seaweed. And so we don't take the fiber out, we work with this seaweed and we just blend it right down smooth, smooth, smooth. The, those are the reds. The, the, the big giant seaweeds that we have out here, our coastline is grand. Our trees and forests here have a grand element to it and so do our seaweeds. This is Custeria costata. It's a really fun seaweed and it's very textured and uh, I love taking Americans out because they say, wow, it looks like an alligator and that's exactly what it looks like. But it's um, smooth, it's soft. The Latin name is Costaria costata. It's like a big quilt. And uh, I work with this with artists to, for s s prints and, and things like that. So there's that. The, of course, the class. Oh, let's do the fun one. This is rockweed. Rockweed is a very funky seaweed. It's actually pretty ugly. In fact, it's so ugly, I say it's quite beautiful. And the. Um, it has big puffy ends on the end of it. This is part of the reproductive uh, system of the seaweed, but when you open up the ends, and this is where I love working with it, it oozes a beautiful, clean, clear, gelatinous, whoops, <laughs> marine-like you know, aloe vera gel. 